A huge crowd of family members and friends are celebrating FAMU Homecoming 2024. But with a week long of events comes lots of measures and precautions to keep you safe. I'm Kenya Cardone at FAMU speaking with students and law enforcement about what we can expect. Are you excited for, for Homecoming? Oh yeah, most yes. definitely. The highest of seven hills is shining brighter than usual as Homecoming 2024 has officially kicked off. It's a week known for gathering students and alumni and showing freshmen like Evan and Calvin what Rattler Pride is all about. I'm looking forward to the Homecoming concert. I'm ready to listen to V's because he's one of my favorite artists. I'm excited to see the Marching 100. They're going to cut up like they do every other time. I've seen so many videos. Freshman Mariah Field says she hopes her first homecoming will live up to the hype. But there's one thing she's already certain about. I expect it to be packed everywhere. A packed campus calls for extra hands on deck. Safety is a top priority. I checked in with FAMU's Chief of Police, Audrey Alexander. She says there are a few things for neighbors and visitors to keep in mind. Just arrive early. Um, allow yourself enough time to go through all the checkpoints as well as all the other security measures that we have in place. Here are the measures she's talking about. Increased law enforcement presence from FAMU PD, Tallahassee Police Department and Leon County Sheriff's Office. Metal detectors at all events, extra eyes on campus security cameras and traffic enforcement and impacts near the streets that you see on your screen. I think that I feel okay or somewhat secure knowing that they are actually trying. With those measures in place and self precautions, Field says she's confident everyone will have a good time safely. Because there's gonna be so many people and so many people I know are feeling the exact same way that I do. They're gonna be excited. And so a whole bunch of excited people just makes for nothing but good vibes. One last thing to note is that a clear bag policy will be enforced at all events being held at the Bragg Memorial Stadium and the AL Lawson Center. Strollers and umbrellas will also not be allowed at either of those sites. At FAMU, Kenya Cardone, ABC 27.